Hello and welcome to Stockwatch presented by me, Evan Lucas for Go Market Securities. As always, please, a very good read through of the disclaimer on screen. Everything in this video is general in nature. None of it should upon is any form of personal advice. Go Market Securities does not know your personal scenario, nor your personal financial goals, and therefore none of it should upon is any form of advice at all. It is just general in nature only. Suncorp has just announced something that probably should have happened over five years ago, which is that its New Zealand life business is being sold off. I need to point out very clearly that it only makes up about two, maybe as much as 4% of total group revenue. And it probably could have gone when it sold its Australian life business back in 2019. It is and has been a bit of a sore thumb inside the business because it hasn't actually been part of its core overall offering. You look at it also with what's going on inside Suncorp at the moment, now that it has been given the all clear to divest its banking business, putting that into ANZ, it is becoming back and truly to what it always has been, a very slick operating general insurance business. The catch that always comes with this is the external. This is not on Suncorp, it's not on its competitors either. But in the current market, insurance is a very, very thin margin business. We know reinsurance is right up there. We know also that the amount of disasters that have happened over the last decade and a half is making insurance a really tough space to be. Now, I do want to point this out very clearly. Suncorp do it well. In fact, they do it more than well. They are one of the leaders, not just in Australia, but across the globe. But it is a space that, again, you have that pressure point at all points. And the unknown movements that happen on the east coast of Australia, the unknown sort of outcomes that can happen over in the west as well, Always make insurance that quiet question that you've got to sit there and go, am I going to see a year where we actually see premiums holding true, reinsurance costs being okay, and overall insurance levels being there? Inflation's helped, there's no doubt about that, and I'm sure that you and I are feeling that in our insurance premiums. But that cannot be the future of how a Suncorp and the rest of the market works, is that it needs to get back to being its core business. And Suncorp, as I said, is one of the best at this. And now that its life insurance is no longer taking up management thought, it can concentrate on what matters most, which is its general insurance.